Oh yeah, that feels good. I think I should be able to start training hard again soon. Flex bar, kids. It'll save your elbows. Yo, do 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 that. Your friendly neighborhood Jack's Blade is back, and I just gotta do a video on My Hero Academia because I am so happy this season is finally here. If you haven't caught it, the new episodes are on Crunchyroll, which I'm not getting sponsored to say, but they are. They're on Verve and all those other places too, but whatever. The point is, My Hero Academia is back. Now, I will admit, I was a little bit surprised that today's episode was a filler episode and a clip show at that, but I I guess it's just one of those things where if you have a season you have to do a clip show or a filler episode just, just I guess because if you've read the manga from my academia and you know some shit is going down this season then we know that I guess they just want to get that out the way and then just completely focus on the story but to me this is the best type of filler they could do I've mentioned it before but I personally love the filler and slice of life stuff they do where they take uh, just the badass heroes and put them in an environment where they're just doing a slice of life stuff or they're training. I freaking love the training filler apps. Those are my crack. I perk up so hard when I hear that. Yes, I know how that sounds and maybe it's a little bit accurate, but I don't care. I love the training episodes. Also, I just want to say I have absolute respect. Yeah, see what I did there? For all the heroes at My Hero Academia, I mean UA, because they just all, it's like the, everyone just decided, you know what, all right, you know the Marvel plan, the MCU plan? All right, every one of these heroes has an eight pack, so all of you have to have eight packs too, all right? All right, cool. Yeah, even you, Belly Buster. Yeah, you, uh, Mineta, uh, you look like a little kid, so we'll let you pass for right now. But it's just one of those things where everyone is just so ripped up, and I'm just like, damn, making brother want to do some extra crunches this morning. Like, if you read the manga, this is nothing new because they show them there, but like, it's just funny to see it animated because it's just like, most of the heroes you know work out, but it's just like, okay, I, I didn't think you had a bod like that on you. And it's just funny. It's one of those things where it's just like, oh, none of them are out of shape. So like if you go to the beach, like everyone's got an eight pack. Like usually when you go to the beach with friends, it's just like one of them or a few of them aren't as like strict on their diet or as strict as their training as you. So like you're usually the one who looks the best out of the group or the one who looks the worst out of the group depending on how you go. But it's just, I, I just love that. I love seeing that like, oh no, when they all go to the beach, everyone's just completely yoked up. Just everyone's been taking care of their chicken breast, broccoli, brown rice, and drinking their gallons of water, <laughs> sleeping right. <laughs> It's like, if you look at My Hero Academia, it's like pretty much all the kids got exceptional newbie gains. And it's just like, okay, we put our newbie gains to use. We all trained hard. If you don't know what newbie gains are, go watch my Wood Deku's training and My Hero Academia workout video. I explain it in depth there. But it's just like pretty much all of them have good old fashioned newbie gains and just like work their ass off. And I'm just like, oh my God, that is, I'm, I'm proud. I just got like such pride. I already knew Ida was jacked. Just look at him in his underarm. I already knew Bakugo was jacked because you just see his butt fast arms. Deku, we already know, it does, does. It's sad he doesn't show it off too often. I really hope when he grows up, he like has like a Baki the Grappler type build for himself. I know people will be like, oh, that's gross, but no, he needs a Goku Baki the Grappler type build. I just want my boy to be extra super jacked. I'm so glad they went this route with filler in a clip show instead of just like, oh, there's a villain, we gotta go catch him or something like that. I, I hate that. I absolutely hate filler villains in shows. I think it's a waste of time. It takes away a bunch of stuff that I'm just not interested in seeing. I just wanna see heroes in their day off, like enjoying life, slice of life shows, or when the heroes are just in their main day, just like, you know, training their asses off. Those are the only two fillers I accept, and I can take those like in oodles. Honestly, there's just a lot of stuff I am currently excited for, for this season of My Hero Academia. Like, first of all, I read the manga, and if you go to my community tab, I already made a poll and talked, not poll, but like a post about it. So there is a bunch of stuff, though I'm not spoiling this for anyone, but there is a bunch of stuff coming this season that I am excited for, and one I am really, really trying to hold my tongue about I fucking wait, you gotta be so freaking dumb! It didn't spoil anything, alright? That could be anything. That could be just whatever. I could just be me being random holding up something. There are three huge things this season that I am just so excited to see finally animated. I don't know why I'm doing the Ida thing right there. So what are you personally excited for? If you're anime only, just leave it, like just write a comment what you're excited for. And if you are manga only, please don't be the dick and spoil it for other people. I'll have to block you if you do that. So this is what you're gonna do. You can either go to my community tab where I have a picture of all my doing this, or you can just, if you're gonna talk about stuff from this season in the manga that you wanna see animated, just put hashtag that and then put dot 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 
So like there's a read more thing and then put what you're talking about. That way if someone's an anime only and they click hashtag that and then they read more then I, I, th that's your ass. That's your warning sign. Hashtag that. Th 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 don't do it. All right. But anyways, I'm curious what you're excited for. So I will say my only gripe is the opening theme song didn't get me like the first two. Okay. I think the first two My Hero Academia opening songs, I work out to those daily because they just, they get you hyped. Either the or the freaking oh. Uh, sorry about that. I just, I gotta say, I, like, I, this new one does, doesn't have that passion to me like that, and the outro didn't either, in my opinion. But if other people liked it, um, just go ahead, like it. Also, if you guys want to see anything weekly from me for my hair academic, because I love it so much, let me know because I sort of don't know how to go about it because it'd be sort of disingenuous of me to like say, like, react in a way like, oh my god, I didn't know what was gonna happen when I do know what's gonna happen because I read it like years ago so it's just like I, I i wanted to do an episode thing each week but i don't know well this one i could actually do because it's legit filler it's filler i can do this easy because it's like oh i did not expect that it was a padding filler episode they're just swimming at the pool i thought that was generally nice i thought that was just a lovely thing to see all the students training together at the pool showing off their diesel sl saying that yeah we're not only heroes we're jacked as hell i love that i love that so much but if you want me to do anything like that just leave a comment below or something like that if you want to do a weekly thing or bi-weekly thing for it just let me know because i'm curious i most definitely will be doing react Reactions for certain things that I wait for like I'll get I'll tell you this much for the three re things I'm going to react to like I will definitely do a video each of their own for those three things but I just gotta say I'm, 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 I love this series I love this series this is a show that I generally feel good about watching I'm excited to wake up every Saturday morning and see that there's this show like I want to wake up just be happy and go Yes, it's time for My Hero Academia. I feel like a kid again watching Fox Kids or Fox Box if you're younger, four kids if you're that way, or Kids WB, Kids W is awesome. But I just, I feel happy watching this show. It's just a show that promotes positivity and athleticism. And seeing this episode made me extra want to diet more. Like, I was almost going to break my uh, diet today because I paid taxes and when you're self-employed, that show is not fun to do. But I just saw it and I was just like, you know what? I, w I want to go exercise some more today. This episode made me want to go exercise. I, I think I'm going to go to the pool and go do like a bunch of swimming laps right now because I love it. And if anyone talks about that damn stereotype that black people can't swim, all right, stop it. You're promoting a negative stereotype. Learn how to swim. It's freaking easy. Oh my gosh. But I'm happy this show just brings just such a light of positivity. There are some moments I know for a fact I'm just going to man tear over, all right? I know for a fact I'm gonna just manter over your next. There's something like that, but I'm just, I can't wait. I cannot wait for this season. I'm excited, I am hyped. I just wanna know what you all think about it. And since everyone just showed how fit they were in My Hero Academia, now is a better time than never to talk about Project Deku. For those of you who don't know what Project Deku is, it is an anime workout based on the My Hero Academia aimed to pass the American Dream Plan. It is a 10 month program, unisex, for anyone to do me and train I went to college with trainers I've met like several times over just like made this program to the best of our ability so that it would be very beneficial in getting you a strong athletic hero body which is not only looking aesthetic but very athletic as well uh, we also are going to be releasing it in parts so the first part is going to be released uh, next week so I, I'll make a thing for it it was originally going to be released this week but one of the people working on it said that they had family issues come up and they dropped out or something I, I see it's one of those things I want to be like caring but it's just like okay I don't know if that was true or whatever but whatever they said they had some issues so I'm just gonna say you know out of good my heart I, I hope they're doing well uh, but uh, yeah first part's going to be released next week um, it's also going to incre uh, include like meal plans and uh, diet and all this other stuff that just all the great stuff that All Might made in his Aim to Pass the American Dream Plan thing is going to be in there with a bunch of trainers who worked on it, figuring out the best exercises to stimulate the best growth, get you most athletic. And uh, it was a ton of fun to make, very challenging, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. I like did a lot of stuff for this, for the PETA and all this stuff, so I hope you enjoyed it. <sighs> Anyways, keep calm. 
Booyah on. Glad that My Hero Academia is finally back. Cannot wait to see this season and see that certain thing animated. And trust me, you'll know when it happens. But yeah, it, I just, I'm so hype. I'm so freaking hype. All right, keep calm. Booyah on. Don't forget, moment tie. Let's go train hard to be like those heroes. Woo!